Hello guys, uh, this video is an entry of uh, my project uh, Jarvis which I have developed for Intel Real Sense App Challenge. So uh, without getting into much uh, introductions I will just get right onto it. So uh, the first thing is source. You have to select the microphone array which is the Real Sense uh, uh, speaker to detect it uh, properly. So after you select that. Uh, you have to check that uh, it has uh, loaded the voice recognition module and the language US English and uh, after that uh, what you have to do is uh, you have to just click start listening and right now it is allow me to load an accessory files it will take a few seconds so when you see that it started is okay you can speak and it will detect As you see, it has predicted what I have said, and uh, currently it is in um, uh, command mode. Uh, there are some problems with my accent. So now some command demos. Open documents. Open docs. Requested application not found. Here are some close matches. Opening the nearest match. So as you see, uh, it has just opened uh, thoughts. Uh, uh, although I said uh, docs, there is some problem with my accent. Actually, it is detect it detects US accent pretty uh, smooth and. Uh, for the Indian accent there are some problems so it will open um, uh, the application if uh, a folder if it understands and if it doesn't understand it will open the nearest match that it will it is able to find and um, as you see uh, whatever you uh, uh, am I saying is just uh, uh, being typed onto this source uh, you can show and hide it Uh, so, uh, in command mode, you can do like uh, pretty fun stuff with it. Uh, these are the commands uh, that you can uh, say. For example, uh, I can say uh, open Chrome. It just detects it as a quotes. Open Chrome. Open music. Right on. Uh, you see it opened the music folder. Uh, open pictures. Open pictures. Sure, sir. And there you go. So, uh, open photos. Requested application not found. Here are some close matches. Opening the nearest match. So as you see it has found uh, the photos and uh, uh, it opened uh, it uh, if it, uh, it was unable to find uh, any application of that name uh, it will just open the search window but now as photos application is installed as a metro app in my system it will open it automatically. So this application is capable of uh, opening any uh, com uh, opening any uh, folders uh, or uh, uh, ex executables on your system that you have installed or that uh, come pre-installed. Uh, for example, I can just uh, uh, use it to open the Intel RealSense uh, uh, SDK with the rest of the commands. Allow me to load the accessory files. It will take a few seconds. Tell me a joke. Let me think of something. A study showed the leading causes of death in the United States are 1. Heart disease 2. Chalk Norris 3. Cancer <laughs> As you see it also like fetches a random joke and uh, says it to you. Pretty smooth, huh? And now I'll show you 
some other of the features minimize you see it minimized all the windows and for example if I have something playing Translate hello friends to Spanish. Unable to understand the second language only. So I don't know why it's not working right now. So pretty, uh, otherwise, it will just. Uh, say the uh, Spanish translation thanks for asking oh sorry I forgot to unmute it I guess mute mm -hmm. uh, translate hello friends to Spanish translate hello friends to Spanish Translate Hello Friends to Spanish. Unable to understand the second language only. So it is unable to detect Spanish right now. But uh, uh, that's okay. I'll show you some other commands. Search for balls. Search query cannot have a null argument. Search for balls. So it will just search for balls, you know, whatever you want, you can search it using this query. Search Facebook. So it will just search for the whatever query you want to say, it will search it in the default browser. So just let me stop listening. I will show you a demo of the intelligence query right now, the intelligence engine that uses this inbuilt uh, engine that gets the data from various data sources and displays it to you in a very nice format so first I toggle intelligence now intelligence engine is on now I will uh, just start listening and say uh, any query and it will just render the result for me allow me to load the necessary files it will take a few seconds lion Using my intelligence for lion, this may take some time. Assuming lion is a species specification. I've got something for you. Rendering visual representation for your query. Please wait. Results rendering complete. Here you go. So as you see, I have to like manually click stop listening before communicating anything back to you because otherwise it would have uh, guessed it as another query and searched it, it also. And as you see that it take like about one, two minutes to get the data because all the data is coming uh, dynamically from different data sources and it is rendering all it on the runtime. It is not as such saved on uh, in any hard disk or any DB, so it generally takes some time. And you have, if you want to see it uh, like full data, you have, there's a scroll panel. If you scroll to the bottom, there is a horizontal scroll panel, and uh, this is all the data that uh, you 
it provides about uh, the uh, lion so first is lion then scientific name then taxonomy then other basic characters like maximum recorded weight height body then uh, an image and who detected lion in 1758 and other uh, features and this is taxonomic chart which you can also see if you slide here so the same chart so it is pretty neat actually but uh, you need to be careful because uh, you should not provide multiple queries uh, at the same time because it sometimes hangs up the system too much uh, different API calls and thus if you are using intelligence uh, I suggest you should uh, say a query and then wait for some time to load the results and then again say the, uh, another query uh, if the intelligence is on it also detects uh, the commands as well as the intelligence queries but uh, uh, due to the accent problem sometimes uh, whatever you were trying to say like open documents and it uh, think like uh, uh, something else and it will then it will search for uh, this query and it will like reuse many resources and all so i will suggest if you are using this uh, be careful with the data and all that's pretty much i want to say thank you very much uh, i hope you like it